Good evening, everyone. All right. Welcome to the Back 40 live stream. It's Friday night. So how is everyone doing? Oh, we got a, I see we got a nice little, a nice little crowd already gathered. So good evening, everyone. Well, let's put this week behind us and get this live stream kicked off. So cheers, everyone. Thanks for being here. Holy moly, I've been seeing a lot of new names flying by the, the chat there. Um, <clears throat> yes, I will, I will get to this in a little bit. <laughs> oh, so yeah, it's, uh, it's Friday night and holy smokes. All right, if you're new here, we have a little thing, little tradition we do when people do what the Irish Woodhound did there. So, everybody, raise your cups. Here's the first Team Woodhound drink to the Irish Wolfhound. Thank you very much, my friend. Cheers. See, we got a new little lady down there, too, kicking things off. Little Oktoberfest mood here. All right, so, yeah, it's... Uh, Tonight's the uh, the back 40 giveaways. Hopefully everyone's pumped up for that. <laughs> All ready to go. We'll go we'll go over the prizes here in a little bit. Let you guys uh, get a look at them, and then um, we're gonna be drawing out three three lucky woodhounds tonight. Are gonna be uh, walking away with this nice little prize package, and then in two weeks from tonight. We are doing the Van Dusen Axe giveaway. So, yeah, it's been a it's been a crazy busy week. We had our first snowfall today. Uh, it didn't stick on the ground or anything, but we have had our first big heavy snow that came down this afternoon. But all week long, it's just been it's been a rat race. It's it's kind of been crazy. So, so yeah, is uh, there's a lot of stuff going on coming up. It's, it's hard sometimes to, to keep up with it all and remember which day is what. And then, like, I had, I had today off work. I had yesterday off work, too. So, like, my days get mixed up. It's it's a mess. It's a mess. <laughs> so, yeah, if you're new here, welcome. Um, like I said, I saw some new faces or some new names in the chat over there. Um, don't be afraid if you are new here to jump into that the comments there and interact with some of the other woodhounds. And then um, later on, I'll show you over there on back40woodhound.com where you can add yourself to the Woodhound map of the world if you haven't done so already. <clears throat> so yeah, it's, uh, oh, <laughs> I will try, Jeremy. I will try to keep the snow up here. Like I said, I'm, it didn't stick on the ground at all, but it was big, heavy, wet snowflakes coming down today. <clears throat> so... Uh, yeah, if it, if it does end up coming here, I'll try. I'll try to keep it up here. <laughs> uh, there's a... Uh, who... Uh, I know... Um, was it... Oh! who? Todd Lacey! You were up here in Wisconsin last week, weren't you? I think you said you were coming up here. Hopefully, um... Hopefully your trip went well. I know last week when I was down on the farm, I think we were like in peak fall colors and now these past few days we've gotten a lot of rain and some wind so all those leaves are coming down so hopefully you uh you were able to enjoy your stay up here in wisconsin taking in some of the the beautiful fall colors hey jesse jesse how you doing first time here on the live feed welcome glad you could make it Hope your week's been well and hope your Friday night is off to a good start. Way to kick off the weekend. <clears throat> uh, so yeah, there's um there's been a lot going on. Um both down on the farm. We had uh this past weekend we had our big fall harvest of firewood where we took down uh took down I think like 
10, 10 so or so trees, and then we had that one great big one, that blowdown that was hung up that you saw in the video yesterday. But the one thing is, it's like, it's funny how you can, you go into like a situation and we just wanted to, what had happened there is like we were kind of in between, um, we had taken down all the trees and then we were going to go start pulling a few up, but we wanted to get that one tree just, we thought it would just be quick to just pull it off that stump. And, but after I watched the video back, it was like, you could see that one branch was just pegged into the ground. <laughs> oh, it was crazy. So, uh, Hey, who's, is this, uh, I think I just saw, oh, yes, the Jacobson Project. Good evening, buddy. <laughs> oh, well, okay, so, um, well, I'll get to the shirt in a little bit. I don't want to distract you guys to be going and doing something. You got to stay focused here on the live stream. We got all these, uh, <sighs> We got this box of all these names somewhere in here. There's going to be three people, three lucky names are getting pulled out. <clears throat> hey, life in the 906. I'm doing good. Hope everything is going well over there in the 906. <laughs> and in the wood yard. Chris in the Woodyard is here. All right, over there on the on the east side of Wisconsin. Oh boy, Kathy and Orlin Brummer are here. Wow, wow. Yeah, there's a. Uh, so, like I say, in the fall harvest of firewood, we got a whole bunch of trees down in the ground. Woodhound Senior and my mom have been. Uh, working at um, cleaning up a few of them. It was kind of nice because we had a couple of big ones that we were able to take down right along the field. So it's pretty easy to get at, but then there was a few other ones that were not so easy to pull out. And there was even one that got hung up pretty bad. And that's gonna be a whole, you'll see that coming up here soon. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hey, look at this. All right, everyone, get ready. We've got, uh, we have got David, son of the Eager Beaver Knights. All right. Well, thank you very much, my friend. Greatly appreciate that. So everyone, raise your cup up to David, son of the Eager Beaver. Cheers, everyone. Oh. All right, now I'm, I am behind on the chat now. <laughs> so yeah, hey, look at this. Time in the Buckeye Vlogs. Just sold four bags two days in a row. All right, way to be moving that wood. This is the time of the year, man. Everyone's, it seems like everyone is needing wood and there's no wood to go around. Like everyone's running low. It's uh, it's kind of crazy. Cause like that's all you hear about is, you know, everyone's supply is running low. They can't keep up with demand. And it seems like this year, there seems to be more of a demand for some reason. I don't know. It just seems that way just from like seeing all the um, comments and just interacting on social media, like everyone's just swamped right now. But you know, it is that time of the year. It's time, uh, people are firing up the stoves. Um, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but over on uh, back40woodhound.com, I put up in the corner the uh, the counter of how much wood I've burned. And as of today, um, I have burned through one and a half face cords so far. So we started the boiler on September 27th. And yeah, it's, <laughs> it's, uh, we're going through it and it hasn't even been that cold well actually the last few nights have been pretty cold it's <clears throat> it's uh and tonight i think it's supposed to be the coldest this week and another chance for snow tomorrow so 
<clears throat> but the other thing too is that all that that one and a half face cords was all pine, red pine. That you know it didn't. In the first couple of weeks, we weren't calling for a lot of heat, but now you know, like tonight, if it's cold, it's I mean that stuff burns up pretty quick. So if I would have been burning like straight seasoned oak, I probably wouldn't I wouldn't have gone through that much wood yet. So so that is the one thing is that you know depending on the wood you're burning it's gonna make a difference how much you do how much you go through because yeah burning burning pine <laughs> you can it can but the surprising thing is is i burned a, a one and a half face cores and i haven't had to clean out any ashes yet so like i haven't cleaned the ashes out yet so it's still um i'll probably do it though like next week but yeah not a lot of ash in the boiler so <clears throat> oh who Isaac Isaac Reichard thank you very much and um, I'll be telling you later on you might even be able to get yourself one of these and I don't know if you can notice but that actually is me right there that little picture <laughs> that is an outline of me believe it or not <laughs> uh, Stanley Keith <laughs> had our first frost here in Pennsylvania all right and he's got the captain with him well cheers to that happy sailing this evening Oh, so let me, um, oh boy, hang on, here we go. <laughs> Look at this guy. Something's rattling up on my shelf. Mr. Jared Hildebrandt. Oh, popped the wrong run out there. Mr. Jared Hildebrandt. Ladies and gentlemen, raise up your cup and give a big Team Woodhound drink to Jared. Thank you very much, my friend. The party is off to a great start tonight. <laughs> yes. So, um, yeah, the Back 40 giveaways. If you're new here, um, you probably either heard about them in the videos or you've been to the website. Um, it's just once a month. It's just my, I guess, little way of, you know, giving back to you guys. And it just kind of makes it uh, fun, fun to do. But... What we have in the prize package tonight, we have quite, quite the, uh, I don't know the word really, <laughs> variety, variety pack. That's what it is. So, uh, let's see, in order of, well, first of all, because it is that time of year, you're going to be out in the woods, you know, cutting, bucking, running your saws, there's going to be a pack of some 3M earplugs and some safety glasses that's in there um there's going to be a back 40 cup so you can raise it up on these live streams there's going to be some stickers like one of each of the size of these stickers and a back 40 youtube sticker there's going to be a back 40 t-shirt the woodhound top gun woodhound shirt and there's gonna be one of these the uh, rechargeable power bank for your cell phone um, and I've said this before on the live streams but these things actually are pretty cool because I've had like multiple times now where my phone runs low and you can plug it in this thing will charge it back up um, this is the one I use, and uh oh, here it comes. The little boss man's here, but um, but yeah. And the other big thing is now that it's getting cold out. I don't know if you guys notice it or not, but your phones, your batteries will drain a lot faster when you're using them if it's cold out. So you know, I don't want you guys to be like sitting out there taking a break from 
bucking up some firewood, sitting down to watch a Back 40 Firewood Channel video on your phone, and all of a sudden, your phone runs low on your battery. So what are you going to do? You're going to have this thing right here to plug it in. That is what is nice about it. So, once again, I'll put this up right here. Um, where is... Here we go. Here we go. There it is. There's the prize package. So you got... You got some stickers, you got a, a cup, you got um, safety glasses, ear, ear protection, the power bank, rechargeable power bank for your phone, and a t-shirt. So, yes. <laughs> um, that's what it's going to be. All that stuff. All of it. Thrown together. The three of you. Lucky Woodhounds tonight. Um, let me go back. I think I missed. Um, yeah. Stanley and Keith. This. <laughs> so that was the thing. is We had this past week. Two big trees. One Mother Nature brought down. But still gave us a challenge. And then the other one was that great big one. That was dead up on the hill. That was another crazy challenge to get down it was uh <clears throat> i mean just the it didn't come across obviously in the video because i edited it down but like we were waiting on that thing it was just slowly creaking and then there was a little bit of a breeze so like it would all of a sudden the wind would blow and it would balance back out and then it would creak and snap and finally it was, uh, it came down. <laughs> they they already saw you. <laughs> oh, we can take this thing down. We don't need that anymore. Hey, they already saw you if you want to come say hi. You want to come say hi? Hi. Uh-oh. He's going to get something first. That could be trouble. If little boss man is going to get something... That could be trouble. <laughs> but like I said, the um, that big tree that was blowing down, that was just uh, that was another one where it was just, it was balanced the right way, on that sitting up there, and its top was really wide, and one was dug in, and yeah, it was, it was a. Are you going to plug that in again? Oh, let's see. He's, he's bringing out his, <laughs> his his purple spider. I don't think mine fit. But somebody, um, <laughs> who was it back here? Somebody was asking if the 500i had a charging port on it. That would be actually kind of cool. <laughs> plug a USB cable into your chainsaw? Charge your phone? Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. There's a big spider looming behind me. <clears throat> oh, what is, what's going on? Let's see it. Lift it up. Here you go. You better watch. I better watch out. Big spider lurking behind me. Everybody says is saying hi. You, you want to come up here and wave to him? And say hello. Hello. Can I have one of these? No. <laughs> oh, hey, look at this. We got to jump over here quick because the Irish wolfhound again. That means, ladies and gentlemen, see this nice little cup? If you have one, after tonight, if you win one, you'll be able to raise it up and give a big wood, Team Wood on drink to the Irish Wolfhound. Thank you very much, Mr. Ronan. So yes, if you are, the other thing is, oh, 
Uh oh. The other thing is, um, I will show you here. This is this is the little. This is what's on the shirt. If you can't make it out on the screen, but that is the. Uh, you know, at the end of the month on October thirtieth. We're going to be doing the Van Dusen Axe giveaway, but The Mandalorian Season 2 starts. So that's kind of like my what inspired me to... Not The Mandalorian, but The Woodhound. <laughs> and like I said, that actually is me with a Van Dusen Axe over my shoulder and the saw in hand. Oh yeah. Sid's Time Outdoors, how are you doing, buddy? Corey Riley, Daniel Atkins. Hey, Daniel Atkins is, it's late enough, so he's out of bed. He's not missing this live stream, sleeping in. <laughs> oh, it's always fun giving you guys a hard time. <clears throat> oh, Craig T, 502, just wait, because at the end, or later on, I'm going to be telling you how you can actually save a little, get a little discount for uh, anything in the uh, the Back 40 store. So don't place your order yet if you are get, thinking of getting one. Just hold off. Just wait. <laughs> Merc. Wait, what's going on? Oh. What? It's not your birthday, Daniel Atkins. On the 30th, that's when his birthday is. October 30th. I, I, <clears throat> that's when uh, we'll be doing the, the Axe giveaway, and it'll be Daniel Atkins' birthday, so we'll have to have like a double celebration that night. And, oh, if any of you haven't seen, didn't, weren't here last week, this is the Van Dusen axe that Mr. Tim and Old Saws, Mr. Van Dusen, that he he built and he built this for the uh, the back forty giveaway, the seven K giveaway. Oh, oh no 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 no! <laughs> you aren't supposed to open that. Little boss man just opened somebody's prize. <laughs> that wasn't yours to open. Oh boy. All right, so whoever wins one of these power banks has been, has been opened by the little boss man right now. <laughs> Where did you take the box? Go get the box. <laughs> I tell you, these kids. But yes, so this is the Van Dusen Axe on the 30th. This is going to be, this is the one we're giving away. <laughs> so, and it's the same thing for the Back 40 giveaways. If you haven't entered the Back 40 giveaways on back40woodhound.com, if you've entered that, you're entered to win this. If you haven't entered that, get entered and you can win this axe right here. This is, and I don't know if you guys remember, oh. The other axe that Mr. Van Dusen sent last week, this crazy thing right here. <laughs> Look at this thing. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. The Dragon Slayer. Yeah, this was the other axe that Mr. Van Dusen sent and gave away. For, or not to give away. <laughs> this isn't a giveaway one. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh, all right. So, hey, hello from Florida, Jeff Johansson. Hello from Florida. Um, <laughs> yeah, the little boss man. I have not seen the saw surgeon here. Oh boy, Adam Carter, AC. Only the second fire in the wood burner tonight of the season so far. Yeah. 
But yeah, the cold is coming. Because it's here right now. <laughs> well, the little boss man just took one of these things, and I don't know why he decided to open it. So, yeah. I will I will still include everything that's in the box with it though. <laughs> uh, so like I said, somebody will be getting one of those. But anyway, why don't we actually do we'll pick one right now. Why don't we do We'll pick out one name right now. It's almost the bottom of the hour. And then um yeah, I should get, I should get the, wait, well, I think he's busy. All right, here we go. Everybody, are you ready? Should we do one now? You want to do one now or you want to wait and do all three? <laughs> there is a lot, there are a lot of names in here. Thing like, <sighs> I don't even remember the counts. All right. Hey, Ohio Woodburner. Good evening. How you doing? All right. I'm, I'm not stalling. All right. Here we go. And the first winner of the Back 40 giveaways is... Tim Thompson. So, Tim Thompson, are you here tonight? Hey, wait a minute. While we wait for Tim Thompson to reply if he's here or not, we need to jump over because that sneaky little Jacobson project came at us for the bottom of the hour. Team Woodhound Drink. So cheers, everyone, to uh, the Jacobson project. Thank you very much, my friends. And Timothy Thompson is here. We have our first winner. Yes. Congratulations, Mr. Thompson. And I have your shirt size here, so I know what size shirt to send you. Um, there's our first winner right there. Timothy Thompson. Woo! Do you... <laughs> well... We'll wait till the very end when we have everyone, and then you'll just have to wait and see in the mail if you end up getting the uh, the opened. <laughs> Maybe actually, I'll just go get another one, and then uh, that way <laughs> that way you won't get uh, an opened an open prize. <laughs> Timothy Thompson. <clears throat> You are the lucky Woodhound, the first one for the October giveaways. You never win anything. Well, guess what? Tonight, you have won. <clears throat> so hopefully, you'll uh, you'll be able to put this stuff to use. Like I said, it's it's kind of crazy. I was uh, I never thought I would use one of these, and then once I now I just make sure it's always charged, and I pretty much have it in my backpack that I take out with me because you never know when you run out of power and yeah especially now when it's cold out man the phone's just the battery seems to just drain down extra fast so Timothy Thompson <laughs> that is sweet <clears throat> oh oh Man, all right. Well, it's good. It is getting close to uh, round two, so we have to jump over here now because Mr. Jared Hildebrandt, Mr. Jared Hildebrandt, thank you very much, my friend. Everybody, raise your cup up, just like Miss Oktoberfest there is doing, and give a big cheers to Jared Hildebrandt. Thank you very much, my friend. So, yeah, what else was going on this past week? I got, I got so many, I get, I don't know, 
like sometimes when it gets so busy and I like I get a I get ahead on some videos and then I forget what I've done and what I'm what I'm filming and what's going on and oh in the wood yard at the the uh, the shelter I finally figured out a different approach to where I'm gonna put the splitter and how I'm gonna use that this winter now so it's been a lot of uh, like I guess experimenting with just different places and seeing how things would work with both ends open like I really didn't notice um, I guess a lot of like carbon monoxide or I don't I mean obviously you can't notice it but I did put up a co2 or a co2 <laughs> I put up a carbon monoxide detector up in the uh, in the shelter but I don't know if it was really doing much good <clears throat> All that beeping was just giving me a headache, so I just took it down. Uh, but I did figure out where I'm going to put the splitter now. So stay tuned for that. <laughs> and that was just a little joke about <laughs> all the beeping giving me a headache. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, the deer, they are still uh, hanging out all the time it's crazy i actually should try to uh like get one to like to feed one like from my hand or something i don't know <laughs> i was thinking about doing that but then it's kind of like i don't know you start feeding them then you got to keep feeding them and oh hey tony g all right time for another cheers everyone all right, you woodhounds. Tonight, it's a good night. Cool outside, but nice and toasty inside. So raise up your cups to Tony G. Thank you very much, my friend. Cheers, everyone. Yep, I got I to gotta pause for a second. I right, do it. Do my round two refill. There's a little left over down there, but it's getting a little lonely. Oh. I will tell you guys the other thing that's been going on. Um, <clears throat> the 500i, I think now is pretty much fully broken in and that thing day after day just continues to blow my mind we had a big um a big white oak that we took down down on the farm that was oh, I don't even know how big it was but it went through that amazingly <laughs> it was but then again, like I, you know, I've said this before, like I'm comparing it to the 291, which isn't a fair comparison, <clears throat> but holy smokes, I touched up the chain, got a nice and got a nice edge on that chain and pff, it just, just chews through the wood. Oh, Slick Willie is here. Slick Willie was down on the farm last weekend as well. And he got to run the 500i for a little bit. Yeah, him and I had to do some, uh, <laughs> we were like the, I don't know what they call the, the yard crew or the crew, like when you're logging that runs the cable and the chains and we were pulling some logs up out of the woods and oh man, <clears throat> I, I don't know, uh, I don't know how you were Slick Willie Monday morning, but let me tell you, I was, <laughs> I was a little sore. My shoulders from just carrying the cable and the chains. Holy smokes. <clears throat> oh, hey, my goodness. Richard Healy. Richard Healy. All right, everyone. Cheers to all woodhounds near and far. Raise your cups. All right. You heard the man right there. Cheers, everyone. Thank you very much, Richard Healy. I like that. Woodhounds near and far. 
it's crazy how like broad of a I guess area the like people when you look at that <clears throat> woodhound map of the world and it's it's kind of crazy speaking of which why don't we just um, why don't I jump over there right now so if you are new here and you haven't been over to back40woodhound.com you can go over there and um, on the uh, there's a little this the little square here the woodhound map of the world you can click on that and then there's a little form it's just name and like a general location and you can add your woodhound paw print to the map and you can see here I mean it's it's getting pretty full we're st we still have a couple states that Idaho Montana and Utah those are the three states left we need to find a woodhound in one of those states <clears throat> so we got three states left that we don't have claimed by one woodhound or another <laughs> so yeah so go over there like i said if you haven't and then um while you're there if you haven't done so scroll down on the home page right here is the uh the back 40 giveaways you only need to enter once like all these all these names i just keep them and i keep reusing them so you only got to enter once every time there's a giveaway you don't have to enter just one time and one time only <clears throat> So, <laughs> there you go. Okay, Daniel Atkins. He's he's gonna get us on all fifty states right there. <laughs> oh yes, no, and that's that. That's you know, you can expand that map, and it's there's woodhounds across the globe, you know, all over the place. Over in, oh, I think we just got one right now. There we go. Phenom one, Phenom one, you must be watching. So welcome and uh, glad you added yourself to the map. <laughs> it's crazy how that's worked. <laughs> I did not think of that, Pat F. <clears throat> that the why they might not have internet out there in the mountains. It might be tough. <clears throat> Greg. Hello to Indiana. Hello to you in Indiana down there. Yeah, so, all right, what are we at here? Let's find out who the second, the second Lucky Woodhound of the evening is. What do you say? Let's mix these babies up. Now remember, you have to be, you have to be here to claim your prize. So... Here we go. Ah, ah. Ray Haywood. Ah, the light. Ray Haywood. Are you here, Ray Haywood? Ray Haywood. Sorry for the reflection. <laughs> Maybe if I hold it down here. Let me turn that. Ray Haywood. Ray. Ray, this is the way. Are you here, Mr. Ray Haywood? Hey, we just got somebody else entered in. All right, we'll give Ray a couple minutes. To see if he's here um, if not we're gonna pull another name <clears throat> you guys will get to uh, let me know I should have a countdown I should have a timer like they get one minute <laughs> I don't know <clears throat> I don't know if I've I don't I don't think I've seen Ray in the comments <clears throat> Yeah, I need a countdown timer. That's true. You know what? I got to make a note of that for next time. <clears throat> All right, Ray. If you're out there, Ray. 
Ray Haywood. <laughs> oh, sure, Flame Firewood. See, this is the one thing that, that's why I have you add on there your YouTube name. And Ray's YouTube name is actually Ray. <laughs> All right. I think we're going to pull another name. Time is up. That's right. Timothy Thompson, our first winner, he's declared time is up. All right. So. Oh, and of course it's got to be a name I'm not sure I can pronounce. David Alzuski? Alzuski? David Alzuski? Zuski? I don't know how. <clears throat> if you're here, David, Alzuski. I think that might be how you say it. Alzuski. <clears throat> so we've got David. David, are you here? Ah, <clears throat> uh, yeah, I don't know. We might have to pull another one. David, we might have to, uh, Shorten this. Shorten the uh, the amount of time here. We're going to be running over. Oh! All right. Oh, hey, while we wait, look at this guy. Look at Sid's time outdoors, everyone. All right. <clears throat> It's time outdoors. Thank you, Woodhounds, for your support of my channel. Much love. Cheers. Thank you, Mr. Sid's Time Outdoors. Cheers, everyone. All right. <clears throat> David, the Woodhounds have spoken. We just did a toast. So, time for another name. And let's see if this person is here. <laughs> this person is here. Mr. Merck. God, why is this? Merck is in the house. Merck, Merck, Merck. So, we have two winners. I'm here, I'm here. There he is. Congratulations, my friend. You are the second winner of the Back 40 giveaways for October. <clears throat> sure Flame. Oh, where was it? Sure Flame. You just, uh, you fill out that Back 40 giveaways form. Um, and that's how you get in the box. <laughs> Todd Lacey, <laughs> your name is not on the floor. <laughs> but yeah, if you fill out that form, sure, Flame Firewood. If you haven't done so before tonight, um, then you're not in this one here. But get that filled out so you can be in next month's back 40 giveaways and get it filled out before the 30th because that's the uh the drawing for the van deusen axe so <clears throat> and like i said you only got to enter once once you're in there you don't have to like every time you have a giveaway you don't have to re-enter so merc congratulations once again oh. Now, gosh, I'm thinking, um, 
we should maybe just go for number three right now just so that um, in case we got to pull a bunch of names <laughs> Nick pixel <laughs> I do not I do not share any information so I think I think your name and info is out there in too many places you better track that down <laughs> oh <clears throat> oh I will be uh I'll be letting you know about this t-shirt here in a little bit um but yeah let's do it let's do number three why not wait what do we got here <laughs> all right well before before we do number three I will um I'll let um oh my goodness <clears throat> we have to life in the 906 oh they're moving too fast I can't grab it hang on life in the 906 cheers to everyone here what a great community you are so correct my friend it is crazy how great all of you guys are everyone that's here tonight everyone on the channel everyone on all the channels it's just it's awesome so thank you very much mr. life in the 906 for that and cheers everyone So, the one thing is, um, oh, <laughs> Mr. Jared Hildebrandt, hang on, see, this is what happens sometimes, so if you're new here, you gotta kind of pace yourself sometimes, because some of these crazy woodhounds right here, <clears throat> Mr. Jared Hildebrandt, because I want another swig off my drink, so here you go, everyone. Raise those cups up one more time to Mr. Jared Hildebrandt. Thank you very much. Cheers. So we got one more name to pull, but before I get to that, um, <clears throat> so the one thing uh, with this shirt, this is now available over on um, back40woodhound.com, the online store. And um, from now, from right now on, since uh, I'm going to make everybody sort of a winner, but if you go over to the online store and in the checkout, before you check out, there's a spot to enter a promo code. If you enter Woodhound for your promo code, you can get 20% off anything you order from now through the end of the month. So if you're interested in this shirt right here, which comes in three different colors, <clears throat> there's shirts, hoodies, stickers. What else is over there? I don't even remember. But yeah, if you go over there, use the promo code WOODHOUND. Two words, enter that, <clears throat> you uh, take 20% off. Anything, you, everything, anything and everything. Like I said, from now through the end of the month. So jot that down, 20% off. And uh, yeah, you might, you know, the, the, the holidays are coming. So it's a good time to uh, start thinking about those stocking stuffers and you know all those uh, all those things you might want to get your loved ones around the holidays and what better thing than you know something something like this shirt where on the 30th you can tune in to the back 40 live stream possibly win yourself a Van Dusen axe and then afterwards watch the premiere of season two of the Mandalorian Whew. 
So, um, hey, Sean, thank you very much for throwing that out there. <clears throat> very, very cool of you. Thank you, my friend. All right. So the last name. Oh, my goodness. Hang on. We've got, we've got, we've got a double shot coming here, ladies and gentlemen. Harry Ellingsworth. Harry, my friend, thank you very much. And we've got the Irish Wolfhound. Don't forget to give a thumbs up for back 40. So raise your cups up and then put your thumbs up. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. And thank you very much, Harry and Ronan. Really appreciate that. Yeah, so if you are new here, there's nothing, there's no requirements other than raising your cup. It doesn't matter what's in it. That's, I, I should have reminded you that in the beginning. <laughs> and as you can see, sometimes things get a little crazy, so you might want to just sip and not gulp. All right, here we go. Let's, let's mix these names up. Oh, I forgot I got to get Todd Lacey's name off the floor. All right, Todd Lacey, you're in there now. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Here we go, here we go. <clears throat> Do we have in attendance tonight, Vernon Etheridge. Vernon. Are you here? Oh, that's the wrong <laughs> Vernon Etheridge. Vernon, you are on the clock. Vernon, Vernon's down east is his YouTube name. <clears throat> so, we'll see. Hey, Mr. Wyatt, Wessendorf. I didn't, I did see your comment. I get, didn't get a chance to pop that up there, but yeah, it would be, um, I've seen a few videos of the 500i against the, the Husky. And yeah, they're, they're pretty, actually, actually pretty comparable, I think. <clears throat> it's uh but maybe someday we'll have to do a little battle hey the saw surgeon is here good evening mr surgeon all right <clears throat> vernon <sighs> oh hang on we have to raise our cups up thomas Woo! There you go. Are you getting more cups in the store? Well, let's raise it. Let's raise this cup up. <laughs> and then I will let you know. So cheers everyone to Thomas. Oh, and wait a minute. Sid's Time Outdoors is jumping in for another double shot here. Uh, back to back. Bourbon shots. Oh boy. <laughs> Thank you for that, Sid. Cheers everyone. Um, what kind of cups were you, were you looking for? Like these kind of cups or like the, the, um, the tumblers. <clears throat> Let me know Thomas in the chat there, which kind of cup you were, you were looking for. All right. I think, uh, Vernon, I think your time is up. So here we go. Daniel Shup. I hope I'm saying that right. Daniel Shup. Uh, 
Uh, God, this lighting is... Why can't I focus this in? There we go. Daniel Shop. Shop. Daniel. That's a, good, that's a nice name. Got a good name. Good strong name. Daniel right there. <clears throat> oh, we'll give you a minute. So the one I'm using. Yeah, I should have. Um, let me check on that. I believe I do have a few of these left. I know that I, I did set a few aside to do like these giveaways. So I'll look and see how many I have left and then see if I can get those back up on the store. Yeah, that's the, the tumblers and the like the thermos tumblers, the insulated tumblers and all that stuff. Like I had so many of them and then they sold out and I have to get more. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I'll I'll double check on that, Thomas, and let you know. Send me a, um an email. Back forty firewood at gmail.com and let me check on that. Help oh, uh oh, here we go. So this is the after this, we're picking another name. Woodchucker <clears throat> Woodchucker Thank you very much. Cheers, everyone. <laughs> oh, you guys are too much. Mindak, <laughs> Mindak Woodown. Right there. Time shop. <laughs> oh, and then this was another, uh, where was that one here? <laughs> Redneck Ed. <laughs> must be traveling on tonight on a plane all right let's go let's let's get this we might have to go into overtime just to get ourselves a winner all right hey travis cover have a good night thanks for stopping by enjoy the rest of the weekend my friend Oh boy, Dave, Dave, is it Bellacy? Bell, Bell, I'm bad with names. Dave Bellisile, <laughs> or something like that. Dave, do we have a Dave in the house? Uh, Dave, another Dave. Where's the other? Dave, are you here? Has anybody seen Dave? <clears throat> All right. No Daves. Oh, wait. There he is. He's here. If I can. Right there. Matches up. Right. Dave, you are the final winner. On the back 40 giveaways for October. Belle, Belle Isle. I think I'm saying that right. I don't know. Like I said, I'm bad with names, but you, my friend, have won the little back 40 prize pack. Woohoo! So we did. We had it. We finally have a winner. All right. All right, Dave. Congratulations. Oh, boy. <laughs> what is... Jared Hildebrandt, he wants overtime, but we did not have to go into overtime, not yet. So ladies and gentlemen, big uh, Team Woodhound drink to Jared Hildebrandt again. Thank you very much, my friend. Mm -hmm. 
Yes, congratulations. Hey, Kevin Brewer. How are you doing, buddy? I hope you're feeling better. Hope you're uh hope everything's going well for you. And yes, congrats to all the winners. So all right. Everybody, that will do it. Don't forget. Oh. In 2 weeks, the Van Dusen X. Woo! Van Dusen X. We're giving that baby away in 2 weeks. And also, don't forget Head on over to the back40woodhound.com online store. Pick, your up, pick yourself up some merch. Put in that promo code Woodhound and take 20% off. So that, my friends, is going to do it. <clears throat> so, thank you to all the moderators for hanging out. Thanks to all the super chatters for donating to the channel. I greatly appreciate that. And thanks to all of you for tuning in and um yeah hope you guys enjoyed this round of the back 40 giveaways they'll be coming back at you again in november so stay tuned for that and um oh jared hildebrandt this man he wants to go into overtime <laughs> so one last big cheers and farewell to jared hildebrandt Thank you very much, everybody. Have a good rest of the weekend. Have a good night. Stay safe, have fun, and be cool. Cheers. <laughs>